Jeremy Lin with the Dallas Mavericks for the NBA Summer League this year. Um, I'm just going to be doing a video blog uh, following myself and some of the, my teammates around going to practice and, and other things that we have to hopefully you enjoy it. And, uh, yeah. Man, this is Roddy right here. Second year going into the league. Roddy, what, what are you expecting in Summer League? Just try to, to win all the games because last year it wasn't that good. So just. So just try to win uh, all five games, that's it. All right, well, there you have it. Right here, about to go to the airport with Coach Mike Shedd. Coach, how'd you think training camp went? I thought training camp was great. Effort was great from all the guys. Uh, you know, we found out we've got some guys that can handle the ball and do different things, so it's going to be an exciting time. I think it'll be a defensive team and uh, much more athletic than we've been in the past, so it should be, should be fun and exciting and looking forward to watching the guys play out there. All right, what are your predictions? We got five games. Well, I'm, I got to call five and zero. Oh. I got to call right. five and zero oh because I, I believe in the maps. Okay, sounds good. I'm here with Omar Samham from St. Mary's. Averaged thirty and a half points a game during the tournament. Um, Omar, uh, how, did, how, did, how did training camp go for you? Training camp was a lot of fun. It was cool to just get out on the floor and uh, work out with a bunch of guys that are you know really good athletes and really skilled basketball players. So it was great, and uh, the coaching points were. were Good and some stuff I really learned, so it was, it was an enjoyable experience. Uh, who are you most excited to, uh, to go against in, in the summer league? I'm kind of licking my chops for a lot of those guys that got drafted, um, but uh, probably the Sacramento Kings, they got uh, Marcus Cousins, so pretty excited to play against him. All right, well, thanks for taking some of your time out. I'm here with Dominique Jones, the 25th pick in, in the 2010 draft for the Mavs. Dominique, what was it like hearing your name called on draft night? Um, it was amazing, you know, knowing that I got drafted by Memphis but was switched to the Mavericks. I mean, this is just a dream come true. How was the trip? It was very good, very relaxing. Ready to get in. Ready to play some hoops tomorrow? Oh yeah, definitely. Definitely ready to get on the court, show, showcase my talent. I'm here with Shane Foster. Man, what do you think about LeBron going to Miami? I think that was the craziest thing I've ever seen in my life. I think that I can't even. I can't play video games no more because somebody played with Miami and it's cheating. And a lot of teams in the league might feel the same way that the season. Hey, we just made it to Vegas. Um, we had a one hour delay, but everything's cool. We're just waiting for a bag, so I'll catch all you guys tomorrow. Yeah, took on the assignment of trying to slow down. Uh, uh, jo uh, Jones, who was playing really well for Dallas. And so I liked what Anderson did out there. Jeremy Lin on the run and headed to the free throw line. That's not exactly the way you accept a charge turning your back on the play. <laughs> no, but a good hard drive by Lin right here. Gets the ball over there. You can see the end of it, and he kind of comes in there and uh, goes up strong, accepts the contact, and has a chance for an end one. So far, very unselfish. That's what I'm talking about. I, you know, I, I thought for a while there, a little step back jump shot, that um, if Ray Allen got down there in that mix, another great shooter spread the floor and stuff. But uh, then gets the ball here, attacking. Oh, nice, nice move yep. there by the Jeremy Lin, by the Harvard grad. Yep. And you can tell he's ready to get the way. Get your three wood out, and there you go. Just make simple plays. You see him the lumber yard too much. Lin <laughs> on the reverse, protected it. Jeremy Lin, really good contracts, and. If that's the case, then you know the argument, the argument for a new collective bargaining agreement would be. Kobe Carl, shut off and throws it away. Sean Foster with Lynn, perfectly tied pass, and Lynn going to the free throw line. Foul. And while while Da was talking to uh, Mark Cuban, Lynn put on a defensive clinic down there, blocked the shot twice. twice. I mean, he was really working on the defensive end. Who's been so loyal to them? You got us.